Use your arrows to browse Houston, TX, May 22nd, third base umpire Mike Muchelinski signals a fair ball after Evan Longoria. Photo by Bob Levy, Getty Images, call it a defeatist attitude, but the Giants really only put up a fight in the first couple of innings of each game. Then, as skill, not luck, would have it, the Astros proved why they were the better team. Although Wednesday's game was much closer than Tuesday's, the whole series just felt like a bad nightmare. The Giants have an off day to snap out of it, but there will likely be some reflection on the last few days. What did the Giants learn? How can they prevent a road sweep from happening again? What did the Astros show them that no other team has this season? All of these are questions that I've been pondering over the last day or so. These aren't easy questions to answer, but simply put, the Giants were outmatched in nearly every facet. While the Astros feasted on mistakes from pitchers and fielders, the Giants squandered most of their opportunities. This just seems to be the tale of the first half so far. When it all seems like the Giants can snap out of it and put together a nice little win streak, some team comes along and takes the wind out of their sails. This might be a depressing take, but it's the reality we as fans have faced this season. However, they are some good things that the Giants have on the horizon. Believe it or not, there is more than one positive opinion to take away from this series, so let's get into it. Use your arrows to browse.